Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Peace be with you. Today is the 1st of November 2023. It's a Wednesday and we give God all the glory. Give him all the praise because you are here to see this day if you're listening to this today. As it says in Psalm 121 verses 7 to 8, the Lord keeps you from all harm and watches over your life. The Lord keeps watch over you as you come and go both now and forever. Give him praise. Give him all the glory. Raise him up. Raise him up. Thank him for keeping you through all this time, through 10 months of the year. You are now entering the 11th month if you are listening to this. No matter what you have been through, he has been there for you and he says in everything, there is joy at the end of it. There is light at the end of it. He is never leaves you nor forsake you. So there, give him all the praise. We thank you, Father. We thank you. We thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our reading for reflection today is taken from the last book of the Bible, Revelations chapter 1, verses 1 to 10. And the theme for reflection given to us by the Presbyterian Church of Ghana is, Our grace is in the present, past and future. Let us listen to the word of the Lord. The revelation from Jesus Christ, which God gave him to show his servants, what must soon take place. He made it known by sending his angel to his servant John, who testifies to everything he saw, that is, the word of God and the testimony of Jesus Christ. Blessed is the one who reads aloud the words of this prophecy, and blessed are those who hear it and take it to heart, what is written in it, because the time is near. John, to the seven churches in the province of Asia, Greece, grace and peace to you from him who is and who was and who is to come and from the seven spirits before his throne and from Jesus Christ, who is the faithful witness, the firstborn from the dead and the ruler of the kings of the earth, to him who loves us and has freed us from our sins by his blood and has made us to be a kingdom and priest to serve his God and Father. To him be all the glory and power forever and ever. Amen. Look, he is coming with the clouds and every eye will see him, even those who pierced him and all the peoples on earth will mourn because of him. So shall it be. Amen. I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. I, John, your brother and companion in the suffering and kingdom and patient endurance that are ours in Jesus, was on the island of Patmos because of the word of God and the testimony of Jesus. On the Lord's day, I was in the spirit and I heard behind me a loud voice like a trumpet. Here ends our reading for today. Thanks be to God. Remember to share it with others. Have a blessed day. Amen.